What's up, everybody? Cheesy Christ here. Back with some more Tech It. It's a beautiful sunrise right there. Look at all those things. Alright, so. Figured some things out. And I for realized I forgot about some things. So the whole Invar thing. Um, we were looking at the induction smelter. Yes, the induction smelter. We were looking at this, and it said Invar ingots. Now, I... I'm just I just realized basically after I recorded the last episode that I when I clicked on these okay now you click on the the recipe for the for the ingot and it gives you this so you click on that and you know it just keeps giving you this you know like well, what do you, how do you how do you how do you get it though so what you do is you click on the blend and then that shows you it's two dusts or two pulverized iron actually and then one pulverized ferrous metal. And we have that. So let's make some uh, some invar ingots here. Let's see, we have our all our ores. Um, it's corresponding pulverizations. Uh, we have some obsidian here and pulverized obsidian, and I'll show you what to do with that here soon. We'll be doing that next after we get the induction smelter. That's another thing that we'll be using that for. So let's grab some of this. And where's the iron? Let's grab some. We'll just make these for now. Just a few. Um, use that crafting bench. So now we'll split these up and we'll put some down here. And it gives you three blend for each two and then one. So that's pretty good. That's not bad. So we'll just uh, we get nine. So that's nine ingots. That's not uh, that's not too bad at all. So we got to go over here. Which I keep forgetting about. Also, um, don't think I have any on me. I think I might have to, oh, I got some diamonds too, that's good. Um, which I will be using these diamonds for a new pickaxe for a quarry. And uh, hopefully if I have enough time in this episode we'll get that set up. Not sure. Um, so we got the Invar blend going into the furnace right now. Um, let me bring up my mini map real quick. I think I'm going to have to go to one of these pools. Perhaps that one up there in the top left corner. Uh, I need I need a bit of clay for the uh, powered furnace. So the tools are in here. Yep. Shovel. Okay. So let's go do that real quick since it's still pretty early in the day. We got things working. Um what else was I going to do? Oh yeah, I'm going to make... So we're going to make that induction smelter. We're also going to make... Uh, what was it? You know, I can't remember now. Let's see, is there going to be any clay down here? Hopefully. I can't see... I can't see a damn thing. Um, that's all sand it looks like. Oh shoot. There's got to be some clay around here somewhere. It's always like these little pools that happen. Oh, there's some oil over there. Mm, any clay anywhere? Right over here. Oh, that's my my buddy Wolf. He's making a little making a little structure over here. <laughs> He's making a house out of pumpkins or something. Something silly. Okay. Come on, give me some. Oh, here we go. Here's some clay. Scoop that up here. Nice. I'm glad I didn't have to go as far away as I did for the stupid cactus. Oh my god. It's so far away. It was just like a half an hour of me wandering around, basically. So. What is that? 28? That's good enough. Good enough. Alright, so let's head back now. I'm going to scoop up those Invar, what should be Invar ingots now. And make ourselves an induction smelter. Wink. Wink, wink. All right, here we are. We're gonna pop this clay in the 
furnace also. Do that. There you go. We're gonna make some bricks. Now the powered furnace is basically the same as all the other things. It's basically the machine frame in the middle, this on the bottom, and then two copper ingots usually on the sides, and then two other things, and then a bucket usually or something, something like that. This, as you can see, is redstone, the copper, and then bricks. And induction smelter is. And what's. Let's see, what was I going to make? I don't think I remember. I think I was just getting ready for the. Yeah, I just made a machine frame and the red reception coil for the uh, induction smelter. I do believe. But we're going to have to make another one for the um, powered furnace. So let's go ahead and do that. Iron in the glass. Oops. Machine frame. Thank you. Gold. For the redstone. Reception coil. Thank you. Do these stack? Oh, good. Good, good, good. And then... Well, so that was redstone. Okay, okay. So we need. Actually, I think that's all we need. And let's just go ahead and do that. Yep. Yeah. Fantastic. So bricks, reception coil, machine frame, redstone at the top, copper ingots. Fantastic. Now this will. I'll go ahead and put this in the machine shack. And we won't have to be running over here for it anymore. I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop up these diamonds. We're gonna put that in the in the other chest over there because we're gonna be spending more and more time over there. All right, machine frame, redstone, reception coil, bucket, copper, invar ingots. Fantastic! Now I'm excited for this for this beast because now we can make the electrum and we can also make hardened glass which will replace all of these pipes and make our energy transportation a lot more efficient and that is exciting so let us mm -hmm, I'm just gonna pop it down for now just wherever because I'm just gonna use it real quick to get these the uh, redstone energy conduits those will be our wires basically from now on so let's put this invar in here these diamonds in here I'm also gonna put the powered furnace down I do I think I have to make some more Okay, I have to make more of these guys. It's alright. No biggie. Just a few. And we'll just go ahead and do that for now. You filling up? No. No, you're not. What's going on up here? Oh, I made uh, two more engines, as you can see. And also, I found out that if you're... See, now, if you look inside, it's got... They have coal, so let's go ahead and give... Some more coal here. And how much do you have? And how about you? Now they're pretty good on coal because, as you can see, the coal does over almost 5,000, and that's well over twice as much as they can even store themselves. So that one coal will go that will fill this thing up twice. So that's not too bad um, when you're starting out, of course. So when they're when the that's doing that. It's kind of just overheated or whatever, I guess. I don't know. That's what I'm guessing. So you just go ahead and hit it with your wrench, and it'll just restart them again. And whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Come on now, stop it. Chill out. How are you making it? Okay, good. So let's go down here. Whoops. The induction smelter should be... You're still not getting power. Let, let's get these guys out up here. So we don't need that right now, but we will need it here in a second because I did start melting down some redstone. So we got a bunch here because we'll need that. 
I'm going to take you out too, and we'll just put that right there. That is just, that's beautiful, isn't it? How about, what if we, let's get some silver. That's what the electrum. Come on, where you at, silver? And... That should work. I think. No, wait, no, it is, it's actually, yeah, okay. It's, uh, whoops, where'd that go? I need ingots for these. So actually, I'm gonna scoop up the pulverizer for right now. There we go. And we're gonna put down the powered furnace. And we're gonna put this, no, come on now, right there. And now you're gonna you're not gonna give me any power. What's going on here, guys? What are you doing? Okay. Um I'm not really sure what the deal is. We should all should be giving power here. Maybe if I turn that down, I don't know. I really don't know. Oops, now I'm just clicking on stuff here. Okay, well, that's just great. Alright, well, I'm going to cut it off here and uh, I'm going to figure out what's going on here. And once I do, I'll get back to you guys. And. We'll see you then.